three, two, one. Welcome back to Pilots Watching Pilots, the show where we watch pilots of your favorite TV shows. Mike, what do you got? Today we watched Sports Night, the show from September 22nd, 1998. This was created by Aaron Sorkin. It only ran for two seasons. He went on to do his other shows, including The West Wing and Studio 60 on the Sunset Strip, which were huge successes. Uh, the West Wing won everything, but this is, I think, his best show. We watched the pilot. Ryan, are you ready to break down the episode? Let's break it down. Mike, I didn't get the episode. It felt like TMZ, Jerry Maguire, and Newsroom mixed into one. Yeah, I could tell you weren't gonna get it. The writing style's very quick. It's like high intelligence, but um, not breaking for laughter or taking a break, it's just talking through all the jokes, talking very quickly and rolling through the punches. What are your favorite sports? I beg your pardon? Where are you strongest? Oh, football. Great, let's talk about basketball. I said football. I heard you, let's talk about basketball. Um, Robert Guillaume was in this, it was fantastic. I thought all the people they picked to be the cast were good, but he stood out for me as Isaac. Um, he's from Soap, Benson. Oh, also, man. he was Rafiki in The Old Lion King. <laughs> and the new one. Is he the new? I didn't see the new one. I don't know. The new one's good. Didn't you see it? Yeah, sounds just like him. He's dead now. Oh, well, I guess it wasn't him. <laughs> it might have been. Maybe they recorded it earlier. I don't know. And he, <laughs> we should look that part up. Yeah. He's in the old. He's in the old Lion King. I know that much. Shit. <laughs> well, either way, Robert Guillaume was fantastic in this. Let me add, Dana, that things that I say in my office stay in my office. Natalie's my, my second in command. She's the only one I told. Jeremy's my boyfriend. He's the only one I told. I told many, many people. Do you remember Dan Patrick and? Um... Rich Eisen. Rich Eisen. Yes. Didn't they have a thing together? Mm -hmm. And Keith Olbermann. And uh, the show is actually like semi-fictionally based on them. Ryan's taking my fun facts for later and mixing them out, which means you're going to take the shot and we're just going to move through that whole segment. Ryan's going to be able to take the shot and go, last week he almost died. This so, week? I'm dead. <laughs> he's a ghost. Take Hubert Humphrey's name off of it. Vice President of the United States, former... Dick. It's loosely based on a bunch of those guys, and uh, that's our fun facts early. So let's move on to the next part where um, we get a drink. Although, Ryan, you had a little special treat for us this week, I believe. I believe last week we talked about what is a male stewardess. Mm. I said that male and female are flight attendants. I mean, they are now because everybody's PC, everybody gets a trophy. Everyone's stuff a pussy like that. crusher? Okay. The actual name is a Stuart. Stuart Little. Just Stuart. Not Billy, not Frank. <laughs> Stuart. Yeah. I'll if let you, you on, process if you were, that. If you were on the Titanic, if you had a male flight attendant. You're like, hey, Stewie. Stuart. <laughs> That's that is completely incorrect. Look it up. I'm going to look it up. Google. Uh, Alexa, play Stuart Little's best hits. Um, let's get it though. Are you gonna hit the button? Or not? Uh, Stuart. Ryan, what are we doing today? We are gonna get bananas. Yeah, we're finally doing 99 bananas. I say 99 bananas every time, and it's never the banana flavor. And this time, we're gonna do it. We've done a couple other ones. Ryan's almost puked. He agreed to do this one today after double tequila, back-to-back -to -back tequilas. So uh, let's see how this goes. I got, maybe I'll pull one more fun fact out of the air. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see. If you just take the shot, we'll just move right through this segment. Let's go. Mm. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh. That was better than oh, I thought. Oh, God. <laughs> I knew he couldn't do it. This had a oh god! <laughs> this episode had a couple <laughs> fun parts to it. Oh, they god. did something that I thought was unique um, in dropping Nancy Kerrigan and OJ, but also they talked about like one of the the big thing about Casey's problems was looking at his son as role models for athletes, which is like a big problem now. You know, this was in ba way back in 1998. And they're talking about sports athletes and should you look up to them as role models because they were getting arrested for stuff. Now they're really getting arrested for like beating women and a lot of real big problems. And they were like, oh, drug offenses back then. 
it's a bigger problem now, and they address it a little bit, and then he realizes, hey, they're not, they don't have to be role models, you know? They can just be, sports can be fun for just sports. You don't have to look up to them as icons or role models. Ryan, are you awake now? Are you ready to do it? And give us your final thoughts. Oh, that is real, I, I, those are gross, man. I thought they were gonna be okay. <laughs> Cause you said banana. Oh, I thought, it does not taste like a runt. Why would it taste like runts? I don't know. It doesn't oh, say runs on there. It, it says is. 99 proof liquor. <laughs> I would not recommend this. I didn't understand it. It was terrible. Um, e even just with an open mind saying, hey, this is going to get... You've been known for an open mind. I'm open-minded. Mm -hmm. I just drank that bullshit. Anyway, uh, I just don't think it's good. I don't think the story's good. I think it's all over the place. The actors are bad, their haircuts are bad. I get it, it's 1998. The haircuts. Um, yeah, I, you know what? It sucked. There's no fades in this show for sure. But uh, that being said, it's fantastic. This might be one of the best pilots we've ever done. Oh, Jesus Christ. I thought this pilot was so amazing. The fact that they took it from like, a little bit of cliche, which is like the beauty of the writing. It still holds up. This is 98. It's not dated. They they take the fact of cliche of, oh, you're gonna be us versus the network, and then, oh, this guy's sad, and then he's gonna be happy. And they twist it to a very good story. This was amazing. To have him, when he comes back at the end, and he's happy and kicking it, you're like, hell yeah, we're back in sports town, baby. That's showbiz. <laughs> like, you were all in. No. I'm all in. I was almost asleep. God, you guys stop sleeping. I love sleeping. I'm gonna get his annex cut down, but in the meantime, <laughs> Ryan, that's about all. Ooh, I'm a little spilly now after that banana. <laughs> shaky hands. Yeah, you think potassium does that help shaky hands? I thought drinking did. Anyways, Ryan, how about you land this bird for us? Thanks for watching. Be sure you like and subscribe. I'm sure Allie's gonna say some dumb bullshit about the way I said that. Mike. Mm. Drink booze. I mean, follow us on social media. <laughs> also, drink along with the show because that's the best part about this show is the drinking part. Also, we watch pilots while flying in the air. Those are three things we do.